Welcome everyone to the second edition of our track and field fails video. You are watching Portal Sports, subscribe right away. And if you haven't already, watch the first edition of the track and field fails video, which is close to getting a million views on YouTube. A link to it is in the description and also at the end of this video. Many of you complained of the annoying music in the first video. In this video, we have only added music where it was necessary. So let's get started. Some athletics competition in Switzerland. The athlete takes a tumble, but it's nothing to worry about. And uh, from Sapalska, it would also be a season's best. Well, Liz Clay got out very hard, didn't she? She was first to rise. Well, from what I saw anyway, but uh, tumbling on the line, that may well affect her for the final, so she'll have to get that scene to. And uh, just keep an eye on it. And uh, lane four proving to be the best lane here today. Merkadin. Uh, Stamets as well of Austria. Austria as well was uh, Victoria. I like the reaction of this athlete. This is the final of the recently concluded women's 100 meter hurdles at the European Athletics Under 23 Championships, 2023 in Espoo, Finland. 20 year old Veronica Bassana of Italy is one of the favorites to win a gold here. We've run 12 8 this year. Abby Paulet and uh, Vita Bomber as well, all taking evasive action from some of these hurdles. So you hit one hard, you certainly know about it. Blanca, Tot, Kambunji, Carraro, Schuster, Bissana, Villalante, and Najec in this women's sprint hurdles final. So Ditaji, Kambunji from lane three for Switzerland. Will anyone? be able to live up with what she can do. Kambunji and a fall of their Bassana. Oh dear me. Bad luck for the Italians, but Kambunji sails through for Switzerland in a new championship record, 12.68, so beating the mark of Elvira Herman. Bassana qualified for the semis with the best timing of all the athletes in all the heats. She won her semis as well. Only two outcomes were expected for her here, a gold or a silver medal, nothing less, but she goes home with nothing. From Finland, we take you to Russia. This is the women's 400 meters hurdles race at the Russian Athletics Championships 2023. The athlete falls just as she takes the lead about 20 meters before the finish line. She somehow manages to get up and makes a final dash only to collapse at the finish line again. I'm not quite sure what happened. Maybe our Russian friends can help us out. This is 24-year-old high jump athlete Laura Zeiler of Great Britain. She was competing in the Division I high jump competition at the European Athletics Team Championships when this happened.
No paramedics in sight. It's her fellow athletes who walk her back and help her sit down on a chair. You could hear her say, my Achilles popped. I need a doctor, she tells the official. The paramedics finally arrive with a wheelchair and some spray. This is some university-level athletics competition in Ireland. There is a very strong headwind the athletes have to contend with. Just watch. The athletes' right-hand side so far, but definitely more of a headwind than a tailwind. Her way, it looks like Neve O'Neill has got away really well. So has Katie Nolke and Louise King. But O'Neill is really powering home. She's got a three, four meter advantage on Nolke. Well, she's just managed to slip up there, but Katie Nolke has came through. Also struggling and she looks like Nolke is going to take the win there. Kind of on rattle there for Neve O'Neill. Yeah, definitely. Quite hard to maintain that stride pattern, even in the short hurdles with that breeze. You can see the wind breeze, reading there, so. minus three metres per second, and, and probably gusting even above that. But um, a good run by Nolk, all the same. Yeah, Katie Nolk. Uh, quite a tight one to call this. First of their events. It does look like Laura Frawley has got the best start there with Macari. And he's in third. Macari just stumbling there. But it is Laura Frawley who's going to come through and take the wind. There just, from about. just about. You can really Hayes. see those breezy conditions. Macari, the wind is wreaking havoc. Yeah. Uh, it's not ideal conditions for sprinting. Uh, a good run by Frawley, though. It is. It seems to be favouring the hurdlers who kind of build into the race. From those. We're in three minutes. We're in four. Campbell at five. Ford six. And McConaughey in seven. Dara Miniter is the first to rise in the centre there. He's stuck a tumble there. It's going on as the UCC athlete Jack McGrath. He's pairing through and Jack Ford there as well. But it is going to be Jack McGrath from UCC who gets it. This is 25 year old Ejim Callaghan of Turkey competing in the women's division one long jump at the European Athletics Team Championships 2023. Once you see what happens to her in the replay, you too would commend the remarkable composure she is showing right now. A foul is the least of her worries right now. Her foot landed on the side mat and her ankle suffers the worst possible sprain. A similar accident in the first video had the athlete screaming in pain until she was taken away. I am surprised Edgem has managed to stay so calm. At least get a stretcher for her. 
We go back to Russia again. Although it looks rather harmless, it's actually a pretty serious fall. Результат у него. Да, да, вот так вот, когда женщины задают тон, да, что-то с рукой там случилось, вообще это абсолютно нетипичные для легкоатлетов ну, ни в каком разрезе быть, по ходу сезона, ты имеешь да. в виду. Тут же оказывается... Ну, он ободрался, конечно. Есть законы спринта, он с плечо какое, да, законы спринта абсолютные, стопроцентные. Сначала бежит задняя поверхность бедра ягодичной мышцы. Данных, да, ой, 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 ой. А вот так and вот, he gets видишь, to go back on a stretcher. Какую получил, даже не, не смог э, уйти сам, хотя мне показалось, что вот ноги... Все ноги мгновенно, такие си, напряженные мышцы, си, они сил, мгновенно среагировали. Сил много оставил, и вот этот вот ветряк руками сделал, да. Ноги не успели за... Э, 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 да, и вот несвойственные верх, движения верхний. мгновенно там что-то... This is Italy. Fra circa 14 secondi si muovono molto sui blocchi le ragazze. Partenza molto buona per Malina Yenuzza Berinde. Kind of like what happened to Bassana in the earlier part of the video. Malina Yenuzza Berinde davanti e poi Teutacala 14. I think this is Poland. Not because she has a pole in her hand. It seems the pole's pole popped out of the plant box. Reprezentantka Uniwersytetu. Yeah, it seems like uh, it's Anna Sulaim that will uh, Take this one. Another athlete oh. falls down after crossing the finish line. 12.65. Five. Don't know where this happened. So, picking up on the two girls in the lead. Some Swiss indoor athletics competition. Gesprung nein in diesem Wettkampf natürlich schon übersprungen, aber da fehlt es wie schon im Versuch vorher, wenn ich das richtig gesehen habe mit einem Auge, da hat sie auch schon abgebrochen. Ist passiert genau. Bei ihr auch die Egalisation ihr. So that's it from us. If you wanted to see athletes die on the track, go watch something else. Hope the rest of you enjoyed the video. Please like, share, and subscribe. See you again. And it proves with one centimeter.